नमस्कार माय डियर फ्रेंड्स इंडिया फायर्स बालिस्टिक मिसाइल फ्रॉम न्यूक सबमेरिन आईएनएस अरिहंत इन लैंडमार्क टेस्ट इंडियाज न्यूक्लियर बालिस्टिक मिसाइल सबमेरिन आईएनएस अरिहंत सक्सेसफुली टेस्ट फायर्ड ए बालिस्टिक मिसाइल टुडे ए मेजर माइलस्टोन एज अर्लियर टेस्ट फायरिंग वर डन फ्रॉम फिक्स्ड अंडर वाटर पॉन्टून्स दिस टाइम द सबमेरिन इट्स लॉन्च द मिसाइल हियर आर द टेन मैन पॉइंट्स फर्स्ट द सबमेरिन लॉन्च्ड बालिस्टिक मिसाइल टेस्ट प्रूव द credibility of india's naval nuclear deterrent indian ballistic missile submarines may now be able to target china and pakistan from underwater locations when deployed second the latest submarine launched ballistic missile test proves that the homemade ins arihant class submarines are operational in all respects Three, all operational and technological parameters of the weapon system have been validated, the Defence Ministry said in a statement today after the test firing. The submarine launched ballistic missile or SLBM was tested to a predetermined range. and impacted the target area in the bay of bengal with very high accuracy the defense ministry said fifth the successful test launch of the slbm by ins arihant is significant to prove crew competency and validate india's ballistic missile submarine program a key element of india's nuclear deterrence capability 6 a robust survivable and assured retaliatory capability is in keeping with india's policy to have credible minimum deterrence that underpins its no first use commitment the defense ministry said Seven, India operates three homemade ballistic missile submarines, and has developed two submarine-launched surface-to-surface missiles, the K-15 and the K-4. The latter has a range of 3,500 km, which acts as a nuclear deterrent against China. Eight. the program to build nuclear powered submarines and fit them with submarine launched ballistic missiles is by far the most complicated weapons developed program india has ever engaged in 9 india is the sixth country in the world to have nuclear powered submarines armed with ballistic missiles after the us russia uk france and china 10 ins arihant is india's first home made nuclear submarine it was launched in july 2009 the anniversary of vijay divas kargil war victory day by former prime minister dr manmohan singh's wife gur शरण कौर ज्वाइन नाउ लाइव बाय वाइस एडमिरल शेखर सिन्हा इज फॉर्मर फ्लैग ऑफिसर कमांडिंग इन चीफ of the western navy command admiral sir as always really good to see you sir big day 
uh, you know, submarine launched this ballistic missile test by the INS Arihant, sir, something that you are deeply familiar with. Your opening comments, sir, on the significance of this test. And it's been officially announced by the Indian MODC. Well, I, I, I really hear the issue about this, but I think that uh, you have been here to open the news. Uh, but I'm not surprised at all, yeah. uh, because the submarine crew has had this capability. The day prime minister even has announced in the parliament that now you can sleep peacefully. Arihan is already talking on a strategic patrol. All it means is that if India is struck by a nuclear attack, the second strike will be delivered as a devastating sort of attack. Uh, over the enemy, and it will be launched from the submarine launch, the, uh, the, the submarine. So I think it's a very good thing that uh, uh, the actual submarine has been done. All the flight submarines have been done, it's on the flat pad, which is a submarine flat pad, to simulate the submarine. Uh, but the submarine always carries this inside, and I'm very happy that uh, you know, it's actually been tested. So I think that, uh, in this, you know, this only enhances the uh, credibility of uh, India. Yes. Uh, of the, of the trial, and uh, any adversary who are thinking that, you know, we are just lying, I think they are mistaken. Highly mistaken, this is information warfare, this is strategic communication as well and very very interesting like I said, you know, I've been a journalist for many years, I was there, and Captain D.K. Sharma also joins our coverage, welcome sir, uh, you know, Hi. incredible uh, Captain D.K. that the INS Arihant which has been shrouded in so much secrecy for so many years, uh, you know, the, the, the veil has been lifted in many ways and in this, like, like Abhishek Balla was just saying, the veil of information secrecy and information warfare has evolved so much that now now you have an official announcement, no, sir, uh, that the INS Arihant uh, has successfully uh, tested a submarine launched ballistic missile. Amazing. Your views, sir. Uh, well, uh, good evening, Shiv, and good evening to all your viewers. And uh, it's been uh, India Today group only, which has been talking about this uh, progress of this evolution of this missile from, you know, quite some time. If you yeah. recollect, you and Sandeep Mithun have been onto this uh, uh, story for long. But as uh, Admiral Sina is saying, that we have been doing the trials of this from an underwater platform. But yeah. yes, today again it has been, you know, this is what is the capability. The capability enhancement which is coming to our fold and into our, uh, you know, submarines. And uh, uh, when, uh, as the Admiral said, that uh, when the boat was put out for the first deterrence patrol, this missile was very much there. But today, of course, as you are saying, that the veil has been lifted, that okay, now we are sharing with our own people and telling our uh, friends that yes, we have this capability and this is how it has been uh, proved. Yeah. And today the firing has been, you know, pinpoint kind of an accuracy, that is what my sources say. And it's been a huge, huge, huge success. Huge success, sends out a message, tests India's proficiency, you know, in, in, in a capability that has been, uh, you know, not with India for many years and, you know, the secrecy apart. The capability is also the big, uh, you know, the, the big demonstration here, Admiral Sina, uh, you know, China, one is always tempted to compare with China because they are the other big regional power here. They've got many more nuclear submarines, many more nuclear, uh, uh, you know, uh, ballistic missile submarines in their nuclear deterrent as well. It is the efforts of our Prime Minister. He is not sparing any efforts to strengthen the Indian Defence Forces. From all the angles he is making Defence Forces very capable and up to the world standard. So it is very good and it is a very good news and congratulations to our Navy that they are coming to the standard of world first class navies. Thank you for watching this video. Namaskar.